In this video, we want to look at doing operations, doing basic addition and subtraction with angle measures that use degrees, minutes, and seconds. What you'll see now, oftentimes is you'll see this little notation, this right here, DMS, which means degrees, minutes, seconds. Okay, so that means you're using degrees, minutes, seconds. That's the notation. Those are the symbols we talked about before. All right, so let's take example number one that we have in the notes. If I have four degrees, 32 minutes, and 17 seconds, plus 19 degrees, 16 minutes, and six seconds. We're going to add these just like we would add anything else. You add like terms with like terms. So that's why you want to line these things up so you have degrees together, minutes together, seconds together. Okay, so in this first column, we've got 17 seconds and 6 seconds, so that combines to give me 23 seconds. No big deal. 32 minutes, 16 minutes gives me 48 minutes. And 4 degrees and 19 degrees is a grand total of 23 degrees. So there's our answer. That's all we have to do. Just add those guys and... We are uh, right as rain, as they would say. All right, let's take this next example. 51 degrees, 26 minutes, 48 seconds, plus 19 degrees, 39 minutes, and 25 seconds. Do the same thing as we did before, and let's uh, let's see what happens here. Now, when I add the seconds together, 48 and 25 is going to give me, okay, so that's 3, carry the 1, and let's see we're going to have a problem here, because this gives us 7. So let's not, let, let's, we know that's going to be an issue, because with seconds it should be between 0 and 59, inclusive. Hmm. Well, let's add the minutes here and see what happens. So 26 and 39 would give me, all right, so that's 15, carry the 1, that's 6. It's going to be another issue. And then for the degrees, 51 and 19 is 70. Now, if you leave this answer just the way it is, it's not going to work out well. And the reason for that is because of this piece right here. Well, at least that's one of the reasons. So with 73 minutes, we want to make sure that we make that adjustment. It's like converting from an improper fraction into a mixed number correctly, right? So if you think about this off to the side, 73 seconds is equal to one minute and 13 seconds. So that's how we need to view this. So basically what you're doing is that you are taking 60 of those seconds and you're going to use that to carry a one minute over. So this becomes... 70 degrees, 66 minutes, because again, we carried that one over. That's uh, this one right here. And we have 13 seconds. Well, now we're running into another issue because we have this guy right here. And we're not supposed to have minutes that are more than 60. Okay? Uh, we want to make sure that we convert that correctly. So just like we did over here, if I look at 66 minutes... Every 60 minutes is going to give us one full degree. So this is one full degree, and then we have six minutes left over. So I'm going to be carrying one degree over, so it makes this 71 degrees. And then I have six minutes and 13 seconds. So that is how we go about adding these guys, okay? You just have to make sure you watch out and that you carry correctly. Okay. It's the same kind of carrying stuff that we would have done uh, before. Well, let's look at what happens when we need to subtract. All right, so here is example number three. 61 degrees, 9 minutes, 51 seconds, minus 27 degrees, 18 minutes, and 40 seconds. Now, working this from right to left like we do with you know, typical addition and subtraction, the first part's pretty simple. 
with the seconds, 51 seconds minus 40 seconds gives us 11 seconds, nice and easy. But now we run into an issue right here, right? We can't really take 18 away from 19. So in the same way that we did carrying above, uh, we're gonna need to do regrouping or borrowing down here. In other words, we're going to take this 61 and we're going to rewrite that so that I have enough minutes to do the subtraction. So this is going to become 60 degrees because we're going to put one degree off of that. And that's going to turn this into 69 minutes with the 51 seconds. And we have the minus 27 degrees, 18 minutes and 40 seconds. So again, there's the 11 seconds. 69 minus 18 is 51 minutes. 60 minus 27 is 33 degrees. So we were able to finish that. We just had to make a slight little change there so that we could subtract without getting into negatives for this. All right, that seems, uh, seems pretty cool, seems doable, right? Let's look at problem number four. This one might be a bit uglier, right? So this one says 91 degrees minus 43 degrees, 20 minutes, and 49 seconds. So right away we can see that this is not going to be a nice problem because we don't have any minutes, we don't have any seconds to take away uh, to take away from. So we need to do something very similar to what we had um, up above. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a conversion within 91 degrees. So this 91 degrees can become 90 degrees. That's going to give us 60 full minutes, but we're still going to have zero seconds. We can see that's going to be a problem because of this 49 seconds that I have right there. So that means I need to do regrouping yet again. So this becomes still 90 degrees. I've got all of that. But I'm going to take one of those minutes. So it becomes 59 minutes. And that's going to be enough to give me 60 seconds. And so now I can do the subtraction here. Uh, we should be able to do this without a problem. So let's see. 60 minus 49 gives me 11 seconds. 59 minus 20 is 39, so 39 minutes. 90 minus 43 is 47 minutes. Now remember with these problems, just like you would check these, uh, you would have checked subtraction problems a long time ago, you can go back and you can add these. So it shouldn't take much for you to check that if I take 47 degrees, whoops, 39 minutes, 11 seconds, and I add back 43 degrees, 20 minutes, and 49 seconds, I should come back up to the 91 degrees. So you would have here 60 seconds, 59 minutes, and 90 degrees. But we know that this is going to give us a plus one to the minute. And then we're going to have 60 seconds, which is going to give us a plus one degree once I make that, that change. So you see, we do get back to the 91 degrees. All right, that was fun. I like doing that. I like making those weird conversions. Kind of makes me happy. I know, I'm a weird guy.